Hello everybody, it's Johnny Icehouse from Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota, your Northland Ice Castle headquarters. And before we get started here, I just want to remind you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you do that, you are going to have access to all our new videos that come out. Every time we get a unit in, we put a new video out there and you'll be able to see everything that we come in and get a jump on everybody else, especially on units like this that just came in. This is a 2020 Ice Castle Trophy Hunter. It's a 17 footer. It's used. We just got this in on trade. It should go pretty quickly once everything gets back to normal. Um, there's been a couple modifications to this that make it really sweet. Can't wait to show you guys. We'll start with a quick tour of the outside and look at the inside and see what you guys think. So we're just going to start out here with my favorite logo. That Ice Castle has a Trophy Hunter logo. Really, really cool. As you can see, this is a hand crank model. So you got your big aluminum rims on there. Now, ice castles generally do not come with a spare tire. That is an added option. So this one has it. Like I said, we just got this one in, so she's still a little bit dirty, but I wanted to be able to show you this right away. You got your cable connection out here. This comes on the GS frame. Really nice, strong frame. Quarter inch tubular steel. And it's got that bed liner coating on it. You got two 110 outlets out here. You got your two 30 pound propane tanks that we fill up for you before you go. Again, cool logo, great coloring on this. Dark blue up above, black rock guard down below. Really sweet. Your 30 amp service here. Nice big bay window in the back. And then we'll go inside. The first thing that you're, whoop, first thing that you're gonna notice when we get inside this thing is that it has the wood look vinyl floor, which is the most popular floor in the Ice Castle line. All cedar interior. And then we'll turn on battery disconnect. So you have your outside light switches, your inside light switches here. Also have 12 volt here, a couple 110 outlets. You got storage right below here, and as you can see, he's got the drill bit here for you to be able to raise and lower this thing with your drill. LED lights are on the top of this thing, so we'll turn off kind of the lights so you get to see those better. Really, really cool. Gives it a good look. Lots of storage up above. Lots of cabinets. Now you can see this bunk up here. So this is a dual bunk. So this is kind of like it, it half folds up and then comes down, but really solid. You can sleep two people up here. I have the dinette down right now. So obviously you have the dinette with a big bay window back here, but I wanted to be able to show you guys, you know, the sleeping of this. And as you can see, it has the camel cushions in it. Really cool. Let's take a look at these holes. There's a total of six holes in this, but I wanted to show you guys this. Spray foam insulation on the floor. I know that's a big deal to a lot of people. They love the spray foam. Really nice pull down curtains here for the windows. Over here we have our microwave and more storage. Place for all the cereal boxes and things. And then your exhaust fan. We have a three burner cooktop in here and the oven, 30,000 BTU furnace down below, really cranks out the heat. AM FM stereo with CD player. And then you also have your electric fridge. Now here's one of the other modifications they made on this unit, which is one of the most popular modifications that people do on the Trophy Hunter is they replace this bottom bunk with this jackknife sofa. So the jackknife sofa still goes down into a bed so you don't lose any sleeping space, but it makes it a little bit more comfortable to jig up these two holes here. And then of course you have your bunk up above here, storage in this cabinet for people above, people below. You know, your kids can hide things in there if they want. We also have some additional connections here 
for your television TV backer right here so if you wanted to hook up a separate small TV for the kids back here you could do that your main TV of course is up here in the front and then we go into the bathroom and you get to see that we have a little porta potty in here and then storage up above here and there you have it so we will take one quick pan through this trophy hunter like I say this model is really nice it's a 2020 not used a lot so it's gonna go pretty quickly if you are interested in this or any other ice house that we have on the lot you know who to call that would be me Johnny ice house you can reach me at 218-355-0623 call or text me day or night this is what I do so I'm gonna answer that call and remember as always you can camp in an ice castle but you cannot fish in a camper thanks have a wonderful day and we'll see you soon